Hey, would you like to be able to change the default internet browser from Safari to something else? You know, when you click on a internet link or you go to the internet for something and it immediately takes you to Safari and you'd rather be in Chrome or Firefox or something else. Well, I'm going to show you how to change those settings. It's quick and fast and that video is going to start right now. Hey everybody, my name is Sean Seymour. I am going to show you how to change the browser on your phone because I personally use Chrome. So when I click on something, a link, or someone sends me something that I have to go to the internet for, I don't want to do it in Safari. I want to do it in Chrome. I'm going to show you that you can download any browser that you want and then you can select that browser as your default browser so that when you do click on the links or someone sends you something you need to go to the internet for, there you go, you're in your default browser right where you normally would be and it's not Safari if that's what you don't want to use. If you don't want to use Safari, it's not Safari. I know that doesn't sound right. <laughs> Something's messed up about that sentence. So let's jump on the phone here and I'll show you what I'm talking about. First thing I'm going to show you is under my settings, there's two places that you can go to double check what your default app is for your browser. The first one is going to be under Safari. And if I go to Safari, you'll see that default browser app is Chrome. And you notice that I only have Safari and Chrome listed. That's because those are the only two apps that I have on my phone right now. But like I said, we're going to download another one. The other place that you can go is further down the menu where where the downloaded apps are and that's going to be where Chrome is and I click on Chrome and you can see that my default browser app is Chrome. So these are the two places that you can go to double check what your current default browser app is. Either Safari where you can find it under the Safari menu or you go under the app that you downloaded and look at the default browser app there. Now let's go ahead and start a download of Firefox so you can see what it's like when I actually go and download an app and does it show up in the menu or does it not? The first thing I want you to do is go to the App Store so that you can see that there is a whole bunch of browsers to choose from so let's go ahead and type in browser and do a search and you'll see that opera comes up you'll see that firefox comes up DuckDuckGo comes up aloha browser so i'm going to pick firefox so let's go ahead and install firefox let's go to settings under settings let's scroll down and as we scroll down you'll notice that the apple apps are always at the top which is why we run into safari first Click on Safari, and right there at the very top, it says Default Browser App. You can click on that and look at that. Firefox is actually there, Safari is there, and Chrome is there. I can make changes to my default browser just by clicking on one of those. I'm going to go ahead and leave it on Chrome. So where's the next place that you can do this? The next place you can do this is going to be further down the menu where the apps you downloaded are going to be located. Now you notice that I have Chrome right here and at the bottom of my Chrome menu here is default browser app and there's that same screen that we just saw. So you can select it there or let's say that I want to do Firefox so I can run down to Firefox and there it is Firefox and default browser app and there's the same screen, allowing me to select whichever default browser I want. Okay, well I hope you found this video helpful. It was supposed to be quick and fast, and all it was meant to do was to show you where you could change your default browser app so that when you click on an internet link or you get sent out of social media to the internet or somebody sends you a link, it actually shows up in the browser that you want with all of your familiar shortcuts, bookmarks, and whatever. I wanna reach out to you very quickly and say that I am working hard to try and hit 50 thousand subscribers by the end of this year if you wouldn't mind hitting that subscribe button down in the bottom right hand corner that would really help my channel if you do like this video hit the like button that tells YouTube that they should show it to other people and as always hit the notification if you would like to get a notification when I release my next video until I see you on the next video default browser the heck out of everything and keep it simple my friend Ooh. I seem to be doing that a lot lately. How to get out of a video. You can't just jump out of a video and go, whoo, no. You have to do some kind of like, hey, thanks. Great, dog fights outdoors. 
<laughs> if you want to know more about which browser you should be using, take a look at this video I've got right up here. Hopefully that's, if it's not, it's over here. <laughs> I can never remember. Is it here? Is it here? I don't know.